This tutorial shows how to integrate the MetaPerson avatars into a Unity project. Let us start by opening the official GitHub repository with the MetaPerson loader package. Scroll down to the bottom of the page. Find the Windows and Mac OS sample and click on it. This page contains the detailed steps on how to run the sample. First, create a new Unity project or open an existing one. You will need to add an additional scoped repository to import the GLT Fast package, which MetaPerson Loader depends on. In order to do it, open the Project Settings under the Edit menu and go to the Package Manager section. Copy the required fields for this scoped repository from the samples page, name, URL, and scope. Save these changes. Once is done, go to the window menu and open Package Manager. Copy the Git URL of the MetaPerson loader package and add it to the Unity project. Unity will download the MetaPerson loader and GLT Fast from repositories and import them into this project. Wait till it's done. The MetaPerson loader package contains scripts, shaders, and materials to load avatars and easily add them to the scene. After that you need to import the MetaPerson Creator Desktop Integration sample as well. Once the sample is imported, open its scene. In order to show the MetaPerson Creator web page inside the Unity application a special WebView component is required. Unfortunately, Unity doesn't provide its own solutions for it for now. So, this sample requires using the Vuplex WebView component that can be purchased on the Asset Store. If you run the scene now and press the Get Avatar button, you will be redirected to a web page where you can get this WebView component. You can also choose any other solution with a WebView component. After you get the WebView package, import it into the project. Select the Scene Handler object and find the Account Credentials component in the Inspector window. Here you need to provide the Client ID and Client Secret parameters that are required to import MetaPerson avatars. To obtain them you need to get an Avatar SDK developer account at accounts.avatarsdk.com. Sign in if you already have a developer account or create a new one. Go to the developer section and create an application if it doesn't already exist. Now you see the required app client ID and app client secret values. Copy them to the account credentials component. Now you can run the scene and press the get avatar button. The MetaPerson Creator page will be shown. Choose one of the sample avatars or create your own. MetaPerson Creator provides a wide range of avatars customizations. For example, you can choose different outfits change a hairstyle, and put on glasses.
Once your avatar is ready, press the export button. Please note that if you've incorrectly added your credentials, or if your account doesn't have a pro plan or higher, the export button may be inactive. It takes a little bit of time to export the avatar and add it to the sample scene. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach our support by email support at avatarsdk.com. Thank you for watching and good luck with your project.